bad wee fish. Lovely colour on them. Welcome back to another video. Um, I've just launched a Tain Alt on Locative, and as you can see, there's a wee bit of mist hanging around. Hopefully, this burns off pretty quickly, um, and then hopefully, we get a nice, fine, calm day. Um, my plan is for a two day trip around the, the Firth of Lorne area, just exploring and fishing as I go. So, roughly 100 miles in all. Kind of a big circular route. Um, so aiming to get down past the sort of Slate Isles, Garvelis, across the Mull, and then up around Morven before coming back into Loch Etiv. Ah, just a dogfish this time. A dogfish here. Yeah. Uh, it's a bit mingy, but put that down. We'll a while longer here. Uh, see if we can attract anything except dogfish. But. That should do us for bait, I think. It's the wee coal fish, this. The rest of them, I'll just take a wee chunk off. And use them to see if there's anything bigger down there. This guy we shot first of all.
Well, I've just stopped off in uh, this little island. I think it's Belnachua, you call it. Um, it's basically it's a, an old slate quarry, uh, which got sort of worked out in the 1900s, early 1900s. So completely deserted now. Uh, but basically, it's been hollowed out for the quarrying slate. Uh, quite a hard place to live, to be honest. Uh, I wouldn't fancy staying here. Um, basically, you've got the workers' cottages, and that's about it. No fresh water in this place. So, everything has to get hauled in by sea. Um, and there's quite a tide run runs around here as well. So, all in all, not the easiest way to make a living, I don't think. But uh, unusual, pretty little island to explore. But as I say, I wouldn't fancy living here. Anyway, just stopped off for a wee coffee and um, just stretch my legs, really. the macro oh. only just made it on board Egypt. Pollock has gone to ground. It is moving a wee bit. Well, it was. That's it away. First decent fish of the day, too.
taking that lead head down deep. This one's a bit bigger. a better fish. Not a bad wee fish. Wouldn't have said it's in great condition. Anyway, pop it back. So I'll get my worm back. Luminous worm this time. Right. Okay. Just a wee thing that. So that's fairly typical of them. They're quite small fish these. Uh, it's maybe two and a half pounds, something like that. Anyway, just slide them back. So most of these fish should just come into fire tails and a lead head. I think it's a 30 gram lead head, six inch fire tail. It's uh, pretty simple stuff. Done a lot of the same. Not keen to come. Now this one's been taking a fair toll too. Uh, so I think it's 13, 14 I've had so far. I'm going to call it a night now I think. Because I could do with getting myself something to eat. Get myself set up for the night. Still got to find somewhere to stop for the night too. Anyway. We'll just head back up the coast a wee bit. 
see what we can find. Well, it's going to keep in the boat tonight. Uh, we're in the, the shelter of a wee bay here. But it's not the sort of place you'd want to land, I don't think. So, yeah, I'm just getting the, the boat set up. Just uh, got a survival bag, bivy bag type of thing. Just for the floor, a couple of inflatable mats, and then just the sleeping bag on top. So, I remembered the cover tonight, so we'll get that put on and that'll should keep us dry and reasonably warm tonight. Well, this is me, more or less tucked up. Uh, I've got some dinner heating up just now. Uh, and watch a movie or a show or something. Um, I'll probably have an early night tonight since it was a fairly early start. Uh, but pretty comfortable setup in the boat here. Um, as long as you don't get too much wave slap against the hull, it's fine. Uh, and I think we're set up for a reasonably quiet night. But I wish you can, we can tell you in the morning. Anyway, I'm going to call it quits just now. So I'm going to say good night and I'll see you in the morning, hopefully, if we haven't sunk. Well, that's me just getting up. Uh, reasonably comfortable last night. Um, quite grey and overcast this morning. So, just get myself sorted. Uh, get some bacon on, coffee on, that sort of thing. Um, and then I park just off the south coast of Mull here. So, I'll just make my way up the coast this morning. And then probably across to uh, Morven later on uh, before heading back into Loch Etiv. Anyway, I thought I'd show you just what this um, being seated of the boat looks like in the morning. So there's plenty of space in here. Uh, I'm barely occupying a, a quarter of it. Obviously there's a lot of boating junk in here as well. but. Uh, There's plenty more space than you get in your average tent. So nothing sophisticated for breakfast this morning. Just a bacon and egg roll. And uh, the obligatory coffee. So, I'm going to haul anchor in a few minutes and just get on up the coast a bit. Getting a lot of wee pollock like this. Beautifully coloured little things, but they're all tiny. Lovely colour on them, but very small fish. This one's a coley, and a few of them too. wee fish. And 
marginally better. That's him off anyway. Another wee cool fish. Typical East Coast sized cool fish, these ones. Really small things. Right, I want to move on up a bit and catch a bit more tide. up something to be a mackerel I think. Yeah definitely. Something small on. It's like another micro, actually. No, no, we call it just a wee baby.
Our next stop from here is the Sound of Mull. So it's just down at the point there. And this is the last sort of beach before you get there. So you could get a kayak ashore. Well, it looks pretty tight for any sort of camping. Um, there's maybe one little spot for a, a wee tent, but I wouldn't want to bet in it. me back in Locative now, uh, so probably back catching dogfish I would think. Oh. I'm a smart dog. First of the trip. Just another of the same. Little, little tiny my spar dogs. We've obviously hit a pack of them. Oh. A small spar dog in a branch. Oh well. been a good trip this. Uh, more exploring than fishing to be honest. But a few fish in there as well. Thanks for watching and hopefully we'll see you next time. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. <laughs>